With a cell phone in hand, Wang Jingwei, a member of China Africa Youth Exchange and Volunteer Group, explains its function. What makes it different from any other cell phone is that it is equipped with a Chinese navigation satellite system called Beidou. With this system, the device can track animals and map their positions. Uh, we can see the navigation shown on the cell phone, and it's very precise. However, the route shown on the phone is not accurate, and even there is a great difference with the actual route. A group of volunteers from China recently headed to the Masai Mara National Park to test the device. We are now beside the Mara River, and this is one of the migration routes of wildebeest. Through the navigation, we can get detailed information of the migration, which can help a lot in maintaining wildlife's migration route. Tourists can also find what they want to see very quickly. With the device, rangers can not only record an animal's position but can get its name. With more data collected, a complete routine of the specific animal will be clear to the administrators of the park. After a successful demonstration, the navigation system was handed over to Deputy Warden Kenya Wildlife Service, a boost to wildlife conservation. Oh yes, it will really improve uh, because this is a new technology uh, which will also enhance uh, better service in terms of tracking and mapping the areas where animals or endangered animals live or how to identify. For the first part, uh, we, we Besides the navigation system, the team of volunteers has also been providing information about the various animals found in the Mara in a bid to create more awareness about wildlife conservation. Susan Mongeli, CCTV.